flexing, yeah. Cause I just checked my bank account and I'm good. I'm flexing, yeah. Cause my singles going off in my hood. I'm flexing, yeah. Everywhere I go, you know it's all love. I'm flexing. Yo, what's good, Crazy Nation? It's your boy, Esper of the Crazy. You know what it is. I'm back again with another reaction. This is to Itsy, Imaginary Friend. Let's get it. Let's go. By the way, if you haven't checked any of my other Itsy reactions, in the description, I have a playlist and as well videos that you should check out from my Itsy reactions. Let's get it. Let's go. Whoa. I love ice, but ow. <laughs> Whoa. Damn, Leo. Who am I the revolution? That is so funny. <laughs> that is so funny. Who am I, the revolution? Once I'm so gay, they are now. So, okay, gay, I'm not your illusion. I'm not your sons, I'm so gay, John Zay. Nickum, dear, do you see it? Guess I'm gay, but I'm gay. Wow. What a fucking shot of Yen. I almost called her Yena. Yuna. Whoa! Yeah. Hmm, very unlike Itsy so far. It's good. They need to make different type of music. That shot is crazy. Wow. They've needed music like this for ages. They've needed music like this for a while. Honestly, this is great. Oh, that's such a sick shot. I love this shot. You're just running around in circles like you're stuck in a maze. Now, what I like is this is more of their vulnerable side. It reminds me of... What's the album that has cake? It reminds me of that album. Do you remember how that album was a bit more... Um, it had a bit more like this. It had like more vulnerable music. Yeah, Kill My Doubt. Because remember, even the title song was a song like that. It was a song where it, it was them being more vulnerable. And I, I remember I liked it because I was like, oh, like, you know, like, let's be honest. There's no way that they haven't been through shit. You know, sometimes you need to start making music where you can connect to your fans in different ways. And I really like this. I really like what they're doing here. This suits them. I said this. It suits them so much. Ooh. Hey. Let's go, chair. Whoa! Whoa! That's 
is such a sick shot. This shot of Rujin? Whoa! Bro, there's a couple. I might, I might use some of these photos for the thumbnail. This one and the one that I said of, um, you know. Bro, there's some photos here where I'm like, whoa, okay, they, they bring such a different side to the music video. Hey. Hey. Hey, Yeji. like about this song the most is the musicality i feel like when itsy's music has musicality they can do wonders with that music the thing with this song is i feel like some of itsy's songs from what i can remember i didn't know where they were going with it if you know what i mean from beginning to end I'm like, what's the ending of the song? Is it just a song to make a song? Or does this song have a story or something to tell? And with this song, this song has a beginning, a middle, and an end. If you get what I mean. It's not just making a song for the sake of making a song. And I really like that. The musicality of this song leads you from the beginning to the end and i really like that having the dance break where they had the dance break it made sense for it to you know like there's so much storytelling besides just the lyrics if you get what i mean the whole song is telling a story plus the music video is telling a story at the same time and i like that i like that it's more than just one thing I really enjoy that because I love music like this. Another dance break, damn. Cold. Whoa, that was mad. Whoa, I like it. A real and complete song, not just an unceasing attack on our ears, which can be great if done correctly or not. And only yeah i agree their signature crown pose the soft but delicate chore choreography the meaningful lyrics such a masterpiece exactly that's that's what i'm saying this song is amazing like this song suits it's itsy this is one of my favorite itsy songs I, i'm not i'm saying that now i like I like when Itzy have meaning to their music. I've always said that about Itzy. When Itzy make good, good, good music where their lyrics hit, I love it. This is Itzy. The, yeah, the crown, the crown pose, soft yet strong vocals, deep meaning behind the lyrics, self love slash self care theme, fluid yet powerful choreography. Everything about this music video and song is top-notch. The visuals are out of this world. Yep. 
This is the best Itsy's been in since what, Loka? I would say. Was Loka after or before Mafia in the morning? I can't remember. Before, not 100% sure. I can't remember, because I swear Loka came out when I started doing reactions, which would say a lot. Same year? Okay. Because, to me, what, what I liked about this song was, like I said, it reminded me of Bet On Me. And that's what I liked about Bet On Me. Was Bet On Me... When I listened to Bet On Me, I was like... How? I remember it pissed me off with the album. Remember, Major? Because Bet On Me had like such a meaningful... Chorus. It had such a meaning... Meaningful song. Right? And then... The rest of the album was just like chaotic or not chaotic but it didn't add to what bet on me had if you get what i mean and i was like why have a song like bet on me and then go away from that because to me that song was such a strong meaningful song like it was very motivational if you get what i mean and that's what i like about this song when I listen to this song, I'm like, wow, this song is so soft, so delicate, but yet the choreography is so intense. The song, it felt, the visuals felt so intense, dramatic in a way. It was really eye-catching, if you know what I mean. Like you see all the scars. You see all the scars and you're like, damn, like, what happened? You know what I mean? You get that, you're like, damn, like, this is real music. And that's the thing for me. When groups make real music, I really enjoy it. Especially Itzy. Itzy, Itzy, with everything that's gone on with them, within like the last couple of years, like, you know, Leah going on hiatus due to self-care, wasn't it? It was due to self-care. You know, like due to mental shit. Because that's the thing. My thing is, this is why I like Stray Kids. Their music relates with their audience. Their music relates to their audience. And I've always felt like Itzy, if they really wanted to, they could do the exact same thing and it would work. Because one thing as well, Itzy are amazing performers when you give them the right choreography as well. When you give them challenges, you see it with gold. They challenge themselves. And look where they are. Bro, like you said, Majo, look at Leah dancing in this video. It's different to gold. Gold is more hip-hop, while this is more... I forget what the fucking word is. There's a, I know there's a, a genre for this type of dancing. But it's that. And I like it, because it felt more soft, delicate, but then it still had those hard hit. It wasn't hard hitting in the choreography. It was hard hitting in the visuals. It was very vulnerable. And I like that. I really enjoyed this song. I enjoyed his song. I enjoyed the lyrics. I enjoyed the visuals, choreography, everything. This song, shit, I thought gold was really good. To me, this is probably, I would say this, I reckon this song's better than gold. Personally. 
Because when I listen to this, I can't think of another group. While when I listen to Gold, it reminds me of Nmix, if you know what I mean. Album reaction. I've had my album reaction planned, but I saw that this music video came out. So I was like, oh, I'll watch this music video and then I'll do the album reaction. So yeah, I have an album reaction coming out within the next couple of days, I would say. But yeah, like I said before, check out my other reactions in the descript the in the description. So you have from my first reaction to Itzy all the way to the latest, which was the gold dance practice behind. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff included in that. Some recording behinds that Itzy have done as well. Just check it out. There's a lot of stuff. But yeah, that's all I gotta say. So if you like this, give this a thumbs up. None of that. Comment if you want to see more. Subscribe and remember, keep living a crazy life and stay blessed. Peace. Laters. Ah, whoop. Peace.